Good morning, my dear brothers and sisters. Today is April 22. Our topic is rather a question. Are you alone in the battle? Are you alone in the battle? My friends, there is a big difference between power tools and manual tools. With a powered drill, you can get the job done in a fraction of time. And most often, cleaner than you can do with a manual drill. The same can be said for your spiritual life. There is a big difference between life under the power of Jesus and life under the power of your own mind. Is there any time you have felt your life is out of control? Is there any time you have realized your joy has been diminished from your family? My friends, it is always better to invite Jesus to your side because even David when he was passing through the same situations as you, he invited Jesus into his life. Let us read that from Psalms 121 verses 5 and 6. The Lord is your keeper. The Lord is your shade at your right hand. The sun shall not strike you by day, nor moon by night. My Brothers and sisters, you may be fighting alone in your life's battle. You must have tried many times to lift your family up but failed. You might have tried to prosper your own life but disappointed. Or you might have tried your level best to reconcile with your extended family but rejected. Your try and toil are like a manual tool. But today, invite Jesus, who is your powerful tool, to revive your life because he is always at your right hand shed. My saints, are you fighting alone to raise your children up? Are you feeling lonely? because there is no support to stand by your side? Are you really fighting alone with all your difficulties and despair? Here is the prophecy from the same Psalm 121, 3 and 4 and 7 and 8 verses. He will not allow your foot to be moved. He who keeps you will not slumber. Behold, he who keeps Israel, shall neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord shall preserve you from all evil. He shall preserve your soul. The Lord shall preserve your going out and your coming in from this time forth and even for ever and ever. My friends, remember, you are not fighting alone. Jesus always at your right hand and there is nothing our Jesus cannot do. Let's pray. Father in heaven, thank you so much, dear Lord, for giving us the hope that we don't have to fight alone in the light's battle because you are there to fight for us. Please, dear Lord, come by our side and you fight the battle. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen.